we just didn't make enough shots. And 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 tonight, when we weren't making enough shots, uh, especially the ones that were open, some we didn't do. We got in a little bit of a hurry. But when we didn't make our shots, we didn't come down and and, uh, and stay as disciplined as we needed to a couple times defensively. And they beat us off the dribble a little bit. And uh, the first half, our problem was we were holding our rotations too long, you know, and 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 actually overhelping a little bit, which is something you don't need to do against Wisconsin because what they do is they just they bait you with their drives to make their kicks, and we didn't do a great job of that. And and they overhelped a couple of times. They made some shots. Second half, they made some shots, especially at the shot clock that you know reminded me of the Michael Jordan, Larry Bird, or whenever they had a. Uh, the McDonald's horse game. I mean, some of those shots that they made. I'd like to see them, you know, take those again. But I mean, they, when you get momentum, and I say that half in jest, but when you get momentum going, it's amazing what can happen. And uh, and they played really hard, and 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 they got the momentum. But we didn't we didn't make shots uh, like we like we do, and and it affected us. It affected us because now you got to come down and you got to play 35 seconds of defense. But we did a lot of good things in the sense of rebounding, and uh, uh, Cody had a tremendous first half. They had nobody really that could guard him, and uh, they still didn't in the second half. They just went with more just pressure, and uh, he still got the shots. He got to the foul line, but we didn't do a great job of rebounding the ball when he missed, and and uh, uh, we just we weren't we weren't moving the ball uh, like we should have, like we do. And, and I think when we see the film, it's not as much them as it was us. But they played really well. I'm, I'm not taking anything away from the way they played. But, but we missed shots, especially the open ones. And uh, we didn't guard that dribble the way that we needed to. And they get the win. Were you happy? Yeah, one at a time. Jason, uh, have you ever seen this team labor to get into transition? Because when something comes naturally. Oh, I don't think we labored. I think once we got down in it, we didn't. Uh, I don't think we labored at all. I don't think they took away the transition. I think we didn't keep reversing the ball. And uh, a couple of times with the, with the side pick and roll in transition, I'm not sure it was as much what they were doing as that we just weren't attacking the switches and we weren't getting the ball to the other side. And, and we were staying t too long, and we really had worked hard the last couple of days. We were staying too long with the first option, which it's rarely going to be there against Wisconsin. And, and you just got to keep reversing the ball. So I'm not sure it was term laboring as much as we just we just started looking and standing rather than keeping the ball moving. I mean, we're a ball reversal team. We're a high uh, execution percentage level team when we're reversing it two and three times. And we didn't do a great job of that tonight. Were you happy with the, the team's energy defensively because they were forcing them to, to have to hit these? Oh, yeah, we touches. played really hard. I mean, we're going to play hard. I mean, I don't – got to watch the film on that. The, the energy was good. I'm not sure the uh, – like I said, I mean, we, we overhelped sometimes. We stayed with the ball too long, and we, and, and we did a couple different things with our coverages because, you know, they, they, their guards do a really good job of, 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 they always do, I mean, of setting it up and then throwing it back to, to where it needs to be. And, and we, sh we didn't need to overhelp. We didn't need to have the extra man stay with the ball. We had it covered, and sometimes that just becomes recognition. Sometimes that becomes... Uh, <coughs> Communication, but it was more recognition tonight than communication. Dustin, you mentioned uh, pressure, they're bringing pressure on Zeller, I guess. What do you mean exactly? What were some of the things that they were doing? Oh, no, I just think they had more guys around him in the second half. I don't think it was, uh, I don't think it was pressure. I mean, they didn't, they just came down on the ball. And, and uh, uh, we got it to him. I mean, just a couple of the shots didn't go. And uh, you know, we had a couple of turnovers. And we came out of timeouts tonight, didn't execute great at times. But uh, they, they just paid. They just had more guys around him in the second half. I mean, and again, we've got to do a great job. We were really wanted to get the ball in the post tonight, and we did. But it's got to come in. It's got to come out. It's got to get swung side to side. There's just got to be more movement. Do you feel there's a correlation between that lack of proper ball movement and the fact that you only had three three point makes tonight? Uh, you know, I really looked at them. We didn't, we didn't shoot a good percentage. That's all. Probably, probably exactly right. But I don't think there's any question that would be correlation on that. The ball's got to move for us. It, it, it just can't sit. And, and, uh, and uh, again, I mean, it, it just, there, there were too many. We didn't have, you're always going to have nights where some guys aren't shooting it real well or aren't making shots. 
But if you're going to be a great, great basketball team, you still got to be tremendous defensively. And, and again, it's one thing to play hard, but I mean, we, we've got to be better. It, it, you, every game is different. I mean, and this is a team that you don't spend a lot of time over helping on because they weigh, the way they want to bait you and make the next pass. And we did a little bit of that. Dustin. You guys obviously pressed them, you know, most, most if not all of the game, basically. Just, uh, what does that say? They only gave it away eight times. What does that say about their ability to just take care of the basketball? Well, you have, you, have, you, have to bring, you have to bring some fatigue and speed to the game. Or, you, you know, this, they're going to try to play the game in the 50s. Right. I mean, it's just the way it is. I mean, that, that's what works for them. And it's great. And, and but, but, I mean, we didn't want to play that way. Um, I'm not as concerned about our, what our scoring, what we scored. I'm more concerned about the fact that when we miss shots, that, that we didn't still have that just, we're getting it done. You know, because you got to come down and you got to guard them. I mean, you got to guard them for a long time. And um, we missed a lot of shots. I mean, what did we do? We missed 34 shots. So a lot of things got to go right for you if you're going to miss 34 shots. Am I looking at that math right? I am right. Yeah. I mean, 34 shots. So when you do that, you've got to, it's going to cut into your possessions. You've got to shoot the ball well against Wisconsin. <coughs> That's part of it. I mean, when teams play well against them, they shoot the ball well against them. And, and we didn't. <coughs> That's the bottom line to me as much as anything else. We, 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 we'll look at the other things. And, but you just got to keep going, man, when, you're, when the shot's not going. This is a second straight game where the bench is in producing offensively as well as I know that you want them to. I said is it, Don, I'm, way, I'm, not, I'm not as concerned about the, the lack of offense from the bench. I'm concerned about the lack of creating... Uh, pace of the game, you know, with deflections, defense. Uh, you need guys to come in and make plays. I mean, Jeremy Hollowell did a really good job tonight. And, and uh, Hunter, it wasn't anything that he really didn't do. It was just Cody was playing well. But uh, uh, we've got to have more talk and uh, more just energy from Remy. Uh, and Will's got to get more involved. He's got to get, I mean, Will's an active, engaged player. And uh, Will's the last guy we need when the shot's not going for him to not be at the same place that he needs to be defensively. He's got to be, got to be way better than that. Last question, Dustin. Uh, what did, I mean, you obviously mentioned the ball reversal, the ball movement, stuff like that. But I guess, how did you feel about your shot selection? Did you feel like you were getting the shots that you wanted, or, or how oh, far I think were you? I, I might go back and watch a couple. They would like, you're not trying to run a stall game against them. You want to take good shots, but, but uh, I'm more concerned. We got. Uh, we just we're not we weren't consistent. We had guys that played too hurried and too rushed, uh, and we had guys that didn't cut and move the way they need to cut and move. Sometimes you just got to cut and move just to move the defense. And uh, I I am concerned that we're not cutting uh, enough right now. You know, back cutting just just reading situations. <laughs> guys like Will, guys like Victor, guys like Christian. You know, those guys have got to do a better job of, of, of when we're just moving. I mean, it's not a – when you call plays is when you're um, uh, uh, sometimes on dead balls, but when you're not getting the movement that you need. And uh, to me, some, I mean, we just want to move and play. That's when we're best. And we didn't do a great job of that. Thanks.